What's going on, everybody? I'm here today, Ryan, with Mike, right? That's Hey, guys. What's going on? And this is episode or number 15 of The Stalker Effect, and it's just the two of us today because I think it's safe to say that the few people that listen, you know, we take this under our wing. This is our thing, right, Mike? Something like that? Yep. And we kind Maybe. of ex- try to extend it out, and it's just hard to it's hard to work it with a lot more people and get it to where it's like can be a a steady thing and can yeah. uh, get it where we want it to be. Uh huh. So I guess we'll stick so, it with this for now. So what? All right. Well, when was homecoming for you? Uh. Ch- oh, let me look. I'll pull it up. I think, oh, no, yeah, last, no, I don't, last, yeah, last Saturday, not like yesterday, but the Saturday before yesterday. Ooh, so, did Corey go? Um, no, he didn't go. He didn't go, or did he? He didn't go. You're trying, you're, you didn't bring it up on purpose, huh? What, didn't bring one, no, I was gonna bring up something else relating to him, actually. I have a whole string of things that I could talk about when it comes to him and, and something. But I wasn't gonna bring it up oh, yet. Man. So Batman Arkham City, seven fifty. Dude, why didn't you buy? Good. Why didn't you get that game or uh, Asylum? They're on both on sale for like five dollars. You might as well just get it. That's chump change, bud. Yeah, I know. You should get it. The Origins comes out in a couple in like next week or this week. This week, I think it comes out this week. Hold on, when's What's Origins? origins? Yeah, the new Batman game. When's that come out? I think it comes out. Oh, this the new week. Batman. Yeah, uh, October twenty fifth, five days. This week, right? On Tuesday. That's okay. this week. Yeah. All right. Well. Yeah. Thursday, Friday. Um, I'm gonna find it and figure it out. Uh, Friday. This Friday it comes out already. Jesus Christ. Okay. Yeah, dude. Battlefield comes out next. Uh, next Tuesday. So. Really? Yeah, next uh, Tuesday. Alrighty, I know, right? I have to, I still have to buy it. <laughs> I haven't bought it yet. You gotta get on that. Get the pre-order bonuses and crap. <laughs> but they're, they're, yeah, stuff's starting to come out. They, they, did you hear they delayed Watch Dogs until, uh, yeah. until the summer? Comes out like June something. It was summer? Yeah. I thought it was just 2014. They said spring, but I, somehow I ended up on the page of it on Amazon a couple days ago, and the release date it said was June oh. 30th. So, wow, they like they delayed. Apparently, there's a couple games that come out June thirtieth, which was weird. There's like two or three games that come out that day, which was really really weird to see. Huh. But it, I don't know if that's what I saw. I don't know. It's like I don't know, the the whole new council thing is jumpy. Like Assassin's Creed, the new Assassin's Creed game for the computer doesn't come out until like November, like two weeks into November or something. I think, yeah, like two weeks into November, it doesn't come out like. The game come. I think Assassin's Creed is supposed to come out next uh, week too, but then the PC version doesn't come out till like two weeks or something like that. It's really yeah, weird. It's, yeah, it's pretty weird. They got like a, they're jumping with a whole bunch of crazy different times and stuff for some reason. I don't know. I don't know what or why it is, but they're just they're just jumping with it lately. I don't know what's going on. Yeah. So, Corey didn't go to Homecoming, but he did do. Something in relevance when it comes to, you could say, uh, like a date type thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, apparently, now, we, we can't, we have to be nice here, can't say anything. This is like a mature thing, what I'm gonna say. And I haven't really talked to Corey about it yet, cause he just, I found out this morning. But, him and Anna are official. Do you know who Anna is? Did we spark into this uh, at all? I've, I've heard of her. Haven't talked it. Oh uh, yeah, we'll 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 have to get together sometime and have some conversation because we don't really have time for that anymore. But that's the uh, that's been going on for a while now. They they do a lot of stuff together, honestly. Spend a lot of time with together, and I have to talk. I'm gonna talk to him tonight when he gets off work about it. So we'll see what happens there. Right. But I guess they finally talked it out there, so they're official now. That happened. Oh boy. Apparently. So. Uh. This has been a, it's just been like a very, very busy weekend. Like, we haven't been this busy at work in a while. During the, like, today we were, there was a line out the door from 
honestly, I got there at 9, so, like, probably from, like, 9.30 to 10 o'clock up until, like, 1 or 2. Probably 2. Yeah, 2. A line out the door? Yeah, like, the lobby full. People out, you know what I mean? For Bob Evans. Mm Mm-hmm. It was like that yesterday. It was weird because today didn't feel as busy as yesterday. It was really weird. Because yesterday we were just as busy. Yesterday was the exact same thing. Except I thought, except everyone that was there yesterday thought it was way worse yesterday than it was today. I guess today it was like, we figured out, like, today I think it was apparently that, like, there was a lot, the parties were bigger. There were bigger parties. Like, the tickets were a lot longer. Maybe that's why today felt like it went, it was, like, so bad. Because it was just, like, bigger groups or whatever. But it was just really busy. And, like, yesterday I was, like, completely drained from it. Because, what, Friday... Friday, I wasn't even... I, I was home for a decent amount of the day. I got to talk to you about something on Friday after this is done. So remember to remind me. Um, but I didn't go to bed on Friday till like, 3 o'clock. And then I woke up for work at, like, 7. And then I was there, there till like, 5 o'clock. And it was just... It's just, like, been so crazy. And it's weird, too, because I only work, like, two days. And it's like, what the heck? But then I have three days off, so it's all worth it. Brief intermission, nobody panic, it's okay. What were you saying about the router? You got a new router? New router? No, 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 no. Uh, well, when we upgraded our cable, we got a... When did you upgrade your cable? All in one thing. A month ago, maybe? Well, we oh. upgraded our internet and our cable. Okay. But, uh, with the upgrade came like this all in one. It's like where it stores all of your recorded shows. It's where the cable comes in, the internet comes in a modem a router and everything else basically but the router is terrible and i'm all the way in the basement two floors away so it doesn't reach here and it's really annoying okay. but luckily now we would switch back to the router we used to have so it's not completely garbage all right it's just not good well that's that's good then we're um yep. we're uh I think we're going to get, um, somehow we're convincing my parents we're going to get a, a smart TV for Christmas, I guess. Okay. And on top of that, we're, Jason's gonna, probably going to get a computer or something. I haven't really talked to my dad about anything. I haven't had time. But there's, like, some speculation stuff going around about what's going down for Christmas and whatnot. Because it's coming up, man. Oh, yeah, dude. So, I mean, that's... I was gonna, oh, did you get my picture? Did I, did I get your picture? Did I send you a picture yesterday. Did you oh, yeah. Me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eight seventy-five, baby. It's sticking true. One more month and nine dollars. I was so happy. Oh, that's what one more month meant. Mm-hmm. I was confused. <laughs> I was, okay. like, Wait, is he gonna I was confused. I was confused too, honestly, because I wasn't supposed to get up to eight seventy-five till like the end of November or something. No, no, maybe not. Maybe that is right. I don't know something like that. It was weird. Like every month, they can't give you more than a twenty-five cent raise every month. I guess. Like, it has to be incremented, so you can only go up to 25 cents per fiscal month, right? Oh. Or something like that. Okay. That's what, yeah. So. No, no, so, next month, it'll be nine, and I'll be really happy, so. Hmm. That right there gives me a reason to, like, not get mad about, like, today or yesterday. I don't know how, I don't know why it felt like yesterday went so much smoother than today either, because yesterday we were clearly busier. I don't know what it was about today and yesterday, but yesterday was felt so much. It, it just everything went so much smoother. I don't know what it was. It was weird. Hmm. Oh, yeah. But um, yeah. did you? When was your guys' homecoming? You probably didn't go. Did you go? No, I didn't go. You didn't go? I, I, I didn't think so. Mine I, was like. What was it like? I don't know. It was I feel like middle. last time we had this, we we talked about homecoming. You said it was that weekend or something. It was like middle of September. Jeez, what? The middle of September? Yeah. No, never mind. I'm thinking. It's all, it's all, dude, October's almost over already. Can you believe that? Yeah, I know. One week and then a week, then like two days, and October's already done and over with. Like the year's already flying by. Your guys' is what? First first quarter ends probably next week? I, I think it... Or yeah, not, yeah, yeah. Or did it already yeah. end, maybe? I don't know. Because our, it either, what? It either just ended this week, 
or it's going to end next week. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I don't pay attention that much. What about your try? When does that yeah, end? Yeah, that ends like mid, kind of like middle of, middle of November. Not really, kind of more towards the beginning, I'd say. But like in like two weeks, three weeks it ends. Wow. Less than a month, so. I don't like it. The the year's already like flying over. It's already like a quarter down already. It's it's crazy. Jeez. Like I don't even know where the time has gone. Like it's f- like the past, dude. The past four months or something, it just flew by. Just. <sighs> like, I don't know where the, where the time's gone, man. It's it's ridiculous. Yep. Uh, did you hear about the Strongsville bomb threats? No, I haven't. I've been out of the loop when it comes to the news lately. Just kind of following the government thing. Oh yeah. Well, so Strongsville City Schools, like two weeks ago on on a Sunday night. Uh huh. Uh, some kids wrote on a wall, graffiti on a wall. The bomb goes off at five or something like that. Okay. And some other random junk. And they found it Monday morning. So they brought us out of the school, and they took us to the stadium and put every single person, like all 2,000 kids that were in the school at that time, in the stadium bleachers when there was a bomb threat. You think they keep them them on the field? Yeah, well, you would think that they wouldn't put us in such a tight spot. Yeah, or that, that too, yeah. Yeah, but then after like... Half an hour being there, they called off school. And then that following Wednesday, they found writing on the bathroom walls that said, I'm going to shoot up the school. This is legit, no joke, or something like that. Uh huh. And we had another, we had like a gun threat, but we went to school that day. And then we had another gun threat. And then we had like two more gun threats. Uh, it's a good time. I bet, dude. Just, <laughs> still going on. <laughs> you know, I think we you... just recently had one on Monday, so. Another one, really? Yeah. Wow. So what, do they just like lock you guys down or something? That's it? No, no, no. When there's a gun threat, they just don't do anything. Cause oh. we have like 15 cops in our school. Oh, okay. Well, you know, at least they don't do anything. That's a good thing, right? Yeah. When you when you told me that they packed you into the same and you put you in the bleachers, you know the first thing that I thought, I'm like, they could just put bombs attached to the bleacher supports and just blow that up. Like that's why I said go on well, the field. Yeah. That's the first thing that popped in my mind. I'm like, that's that's no. But, well they didn't they didn't know that we were going to the bleachers. Like yeah. the off like the administrators didn't even know yeah, like, I mean, where to put us. I'm just like so like I like you know me and my I'm like all fucked up yeah <laughs> fucked up in the head and it's like if I were to shoot up the school or blow blow something up I would do that yeah that is the legit legitimate thing to do here that's what we're gonna go for right there mm-hmm. it's gonna happen gonna work yeah but like putting us putting two thousand people in a confined space like yeah it's just like a, just like a football stadium even going there is like what what are you doing yeah you know. I don't know. Yeah, well, so, I mean, if you think about it too, where else are you going to put them? Are going to put them out in the parking lot? You know, where else? Well, now they're going to, they say they're going to walk us over to, like, Mark's or something. Good times. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So messed up, I swear to God. All this crap. I don't know. That's what you get for living in Rich Town, Strongsville. Yeah, sure, Rich Town, Strongsville. So, <laughs> fuck. Oh, wow. I'm trying to think. What's going on? I felt like something kind of decent, decent in size happened at our school lately, but I can't remember what it was. I can't. Maybe, eh, maybe it probably was nothing. I feel like there was something, maybe semi little that happened. Where we had some, little. yeah, semi, semi small that we had people geeking out for. But I can't remember. So it must not have been anything. <laughs> I don't know. My, my school's just retarded. I don't. I, I don't know. It's weird. This, I'm already, I'm like doing really good in the school, right? First try. I can guarantee you it's just going to completely go downhill after this for some reason. It just always does. I don't know what really? it is or what happened. Your second, 
your second try is like the worst? No, my second try is all my my tries get progressively easier, or in theory they should be getting easier. Oh, in theory at least. This is my hardest try, hardest classes, and the classes really aren't even that hard either. So it's like, I don't. But you know me, I don't try to excel in school. I have English, physics, uh, FST, journalism, and graphic design. Oh. So, so three core classes, but physics honestly is not nearly as hard as I expected it to be. It's so easy. Yeah. Physics is honestly mm-hmm. the easiest science you, you could ever take. It's, it's all it is is math. It's just math problems. That's all it is. Conceptual math. Yeah, so. well, it's not like, it's like here's your problem. Yeah, I'm in, and then apply well, it. Well, I'm in to, AP physics, so. It can't, it's honestly not that different. It can't be, because honors physics at our school is not different, much different than regular physics. All that's different yeah, but, is you go faster and the tests are one problem. That's all Vaughn said. He's like, the tests are just one problem. Wow, that's uh, strange. Our tests yeah. are only like four, six problems. Our tests are like, I don't know, like probably like six multiple choice and then like two or like two or three uh, written response. Like written response or like, I don't know. I don't like, I, solve our, this equation. Yeah, solve this equation kind of thing. Yeah, like here's your thing, find this, find that. Vector, 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 solve this vector. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, I got you. Uh-huh. And then English is just really easy, and math is somehow easy. I've been—I don't know if it's really easy. It's just, I guess I'm good at it. I don't. It's not really hard. It's just triangles and circles and. Yeah, is it? There's nothing new, right? No, not well. All the circle stuff's kind of new. Oh, okay. It's not like new, Wait. new, but. You've seen things relating to it when it comes to like pi, so you can like relate it to it, and it just makes it it makes sense. So it's uh, not like completely new. Yeah. But apparently the stuff that we learned, we just like we just finished learning was the hardest stuff we're gonna do like either this try or all year. She said so. It's like that really wasn't even that hard. Huh. So I don't. That's like. That's whatever. How many honors classes are you in this year? Uh, honors classes? Or AP classes. The higher, hardcore, advanced, placement, fuck you uh, classes. Let me see. Um, one, two, three. Three? But well, I'm yeah. guessing math. Math, you said physics and English? Sure. No, math. I mean, two AP maths and then one... AP physics. Oh, okay. So I have I have uh, AP physics C1 and uh, AP BC calc and then AP computer science. Oh, okay. So yeah. what, what's what's AP computer science? Programming. Programming. Okay. Yeah. I got you. But the te- oh my god the, the teacher that teaches that class dumbest teacher I've ever met. Literally, she does not know anything about anything, like computers. I I swear to God, she only knows how to open the program, programming program, and turn a computer on. She has no idea what she's doing any of the other times. I wouldn't doubt it. It's She's so dumb. I mean, no one said you had to know how to actually learn. You had to know how to use a computer to program it. You just thought it'd make sense. Well, well, she just, she's teaching the class, so she did, she should at least know what she's talking about. So. She should, but she won't. Yeah. But they don't. That's the funniest thing about some teachers. It's like they should know this and they should do this, but they, they, they don't. Yeah. You know, it's just, it's <sighs> okay. Ouch. Yeah. And then, uh, uh, for English, I have a project, or part of a project due tomorrow. Mm-hmm. And I was supposed to visit, uh, some, some outdoor amphitheater in Cleveland. Uh huh. And I never did it. So. So I, I can just take pictures. Oh, so, so you're going to tell her that the camera I used broke. I bet so. they'll believe you too. Yeah. She probably will. That's what they, so. somehow they do that. Somehow teachers believe, whenever 
it's a weird thing when it comes to like bigger schools or whatnot. Teacher, you can tell teachers like crazy things or whatever. Not really crazy things, but just make up excuses for stuff, and they'll believe you. Like they don't care. <laughs> but like you try to do that in my school, they're like, no, that's not what happened. Don't even try that. Just stop. You failed. And you're like, oh well, it was worth a shot. So. <laughs> I, I wonder say. how many points I'll get off if I didn't visit. I don't know, probably not that much. Actually, no, this whole project is visiting it, so you failed. You suck. Uh, I don't know about that. Give up, Mike. We only need one source from that, and we need four other ones, so. Alright. So, when are you getting all your stuff for your computer, bud? Ouch. I think I'm going to order it either tonight or tomorrow. You didn't order it yet, I thought you already ordered it. No, I need my sister. She wouldn't order it for me. Okay. Don't you have your own credit card? Nope. Debit card? Get your own debit card. What are you doing? You have a job? I can't. They won't let me. Why won't they let you? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense at all. <sighs> well, you know, it's my family. Hey, hopefully all that stuff will be here in time for Battlefield. Oh, it will. Good. Two-day shipping. No, oh, you pay for that? I don't even pay for that stuff. I'm a cheap. I'm a cheapy. Well, we have Amazon Prime, so. Oh. We get it through Eileen's College. Oh. 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 <laughs> Fancy man. Uh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> shut up. I bought um, I bought a drawing tablet thing, for uh. Really? Yeah. For your computer. For, yeah. There, there weren't. It wasn't even that expensive, honestly, for the size of it and for what you could do with it. I didn't think it was a bad buy at all. How much was it? It was only. It was only ninety-eight dollars. Like. And for what you can do with it, and how e- easy it makes it when you're in the programs, like when you're using Adobe Flash, I'm gonna use how to use. I'm learning how to use that program because I want to animate and do that stuff or try to learn it. Oh uh, yeah. Because it, it's it, I don't know it, it's something fun, and honestly, we could do cool stuff with it. It's not hard, you know. Hmm. Honestly, the hardest stuff to do when it comes to doing projects like that, just like when it comes to let's plays and stuff, is to have an idea that's original. You know what I mean? Yeah. Have like an original script or original sh- like thing to just make like a two minute skit out of that's the hardest Mm -hmm. part of the whole thing animating it and recording the audio from the different people is so easy and we have all the stuff to do it with but it just makes it easier because you know i watched the one thing from the one guy from this one guy and all you do basically to basic animation is you just use your basic character just standing there and then you just for every little keynote you just change it a little bit with like a pen or you just draw you use that as a base the original one and just draw a little bit around it hmm. and you just kind of keep expanding it or shrinking it basically that's all you do that's all it is it's not wow. it's just and another thing I, le- I saw and I learned is that you can once you have like a base character model let's say we use you for your you're an animation character right because you'll have we'll have one for you right I I run through there and I mm-hmm. create the basic vowel and mouth movements and hand motions, eye motions, and all that. I create that all once. It's all there. It's all created. I don't have to go through there every single time and create it again. You save it and it's like it like saves in a way or whatnot and it's there and as a keynote and a keyframe. So all you have to do is go back in and sync it with up with the audio again and whatnot. Really? Yeah, that's what that's that what makes it, said. it seem so simple. It, it it is like when you that's why it I guess it's kind of simpler to use the same basic characters or whatnot and kind of have a more general skit because you have all, everything's there. There's programs I guess where you can save the keyframes and stuff and keynotes. And like with how the way Adobe programs work, all you do is you take one file from Adobe and you drag it right into the other pro, the other uh, program. Or into a new file, and you have that base program plus the one you want you had from before, or a new one. Do you ever get a uh, Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator? I have Photoshop. Uh, it's a good start for thumbnails. I have Photoshop. I I have uh, Illustrator and After Effects downloaded. I still have yet to uh, quote unquote purchase. Those. Purchase them. All right, but. So I'm gonna this week I have three days off, so hopefully I'm gonna get some time in on Adobe Flash and uh Wait, you have three days off? Off work. Oh wait, from work. Off okay. work, yeah. Whenever I say days off, Friday was my first day off, like off off in 
Exactly. Weird. I don't even know how long. <laughs> like months. My first whole day of like nothing. And it was awesome. <laughs> like nothing. No school, no work. It was awesome. So. What did you do? Uh, what did you do? Friday. I actually, I slept in. I've, I realized it's really weird. I literally only can get about six or seven hours of sleep every night. Usually I get less than that. But like, after oh. that, if I get more than that, like Friday, when I woke up, I woke up at like 11, and my head hurt, and I didn't feel good, because <laughs> I like overslept or whatever. <laughs> like legit, because I woke up at 7, and I was like, oh my god, I feel good, time to get up. But then I was like, it's 7 o'clock, I don't have to get up, I'm going back to bed. So I slept for another like three hours, right? And then I, but um, yeah, Courtney came over and we went to a hockey game that night. Hockey game? Yeah, Monsters. Oh yeah. They won in a shootout. Really? Yeah. They're a good hockey team, honestly. They're a good, uh, minor league hockey team. Yeah, well, minor league. Yeah. So. Maybe one day. Hey, well, honestly, if you think about it, Cleveland won't have an NHL team probably ever, because Columbus has one. You know what I mean? Like, there's yeah. no reason for Ohio to get another hockey team, really. Maybe, maybe in a sense because it's up near the lake, kind of near Canada or whatnot. But I don't, I just don't see it, the funding for it or someone, you know what I mean? Unless a team like came to, to Cleveland. Them. Not an NHL team, I don't think. I think it was. Was it an NHL team? Uh, what were they called? The, the Barons? Red Barons? Someone, I heard from somewhere about the Red Barons, but, or something about like that. Was it a, another a um AHL team or was it an NHL team? Um, uh oh. Maybe all right. Maybe it was minor. Oh wait. Because I do remember wait. hearing about there being something, but I don't remember what league it being in. Yeah, uh, the Cleveland Barons were a professional ice hockey team in the National Hockey League (NHL) from '76 to '78. That's two okay. years though. <laughs> where'd they go at where'd they go after that? Uh they were relocated. They they were a relocation oh no. Wait. Uh they merged with the Minnesota North Stars, now the Dallas Stars. Okay. I got you then. That makes sense. Uh oh wait, what? Oh, no. Okay. That makes, uh, okay. I forgot. I didn't know that they were so long ago. I, cause I mean, I forget who brought, you or Corey might have brought that up one of these times when we were talking, someone was talking about hockey with me. And they brought it up and I was like, I don't think so because I don't remember there, like, not in my lifetime do I remember there being a Cleveland hockey team. Besides yeah. the Monsters or whatever, right? But. Uh huh. I know they're a good team. It was a good game. They almost, I thought they were gonna lose because they gave up like, I forget what the score was. They gave up two goals in the third period and they were up two to zero and they gave up two goals, but then they killed it in the shootout. They shut them out 3-0. Oh. <laughs> in the shootout. So. Yeah. That was cool. Mm -hmm. But I got a couple more games I'm going to this year for them. I like hockey games. They're really? fun. Yeah, hockey games are fun, honestly. They're... When does the season start? And um. Season started at the beginning of this month, I want to say, and oh, okay. it ends like in March. Oh yeah. Hockey it's... and baseball are like the same thing, except they play hockey plays less games, but it's spread out a lot more. Like hockey goes like six months. You know baseball what I mean? Baseball goes like nine months. Well, it might be longer than six months, but I, I'm just I, I'm just trying to think. But it does go a long time. Honestly, I think uh, the playoffs. For, yeah, I think because the playoffs for hockey might go into like summer even. I can't yeah. remember though. But I mean, like, it's like a long season because when you think of like when you think of like sports seasons, you think of football, and that's the shortest sports season there is. It's not long at all. Um, well, I don't think it's long. Yeah, yeah. That's not really that long yeah. compared to other sports. It's the short, yeah, it's the shortest. You know, seventeen weeks. Mhm. Mm so. Or twenty week. Uh, yeah, include the playoffs shortest. or whatever. Let's see. You got the. Preseason. How you can yeah, you can count, you can count preseason too. Regular season, and then you got the playoffs. 
So, yeah, pretty short. Yeah. Compared to other sports, so. Because when you think of other sports, you think of the regular season, and that's like over six months itself. And then you add playoffs, which is another month, month and a half. Mm hmm. So. It's, uh, pretty long. Mm hmm. <laughs> Basketball's so, pretty long. Yeah, bas- yeah. Basketball is decently long. Yeah. Like, ba- basketball and hockey are kind of like the same thing when it comes to season length and how they space out their games and whatnot. Yeah. It's, I, I, that's what I, that's what, that's how I think of it as or whatever. Yeah. But, it's, uh, I was gonna say, hey, what are we gonna do for Let's Plays, Mike? Oh, jeez. Alright, how, um, how are we gonna do this? Over to Steam. Like, you know, I have a Open shit ton of games. Open it up. I mean, we could do there something as simple as, uh, I mean, you have, did, did you ever download Fraps? Fraps? Oh yeah, I got Fraps. I think the easiest thing for us to do is to record with Fraps, right? Each of us, we start at the same time. We go like, three, two, one, we both click the start button, right? Yeah. And then what one of us do, you can do it, I, could, I really don't care, but you would, let's say we do this, I'll use you, you as the first example. You start, okay, or whatever. You take all your Fraps files, or all the gameplay footage, compile it maybe into one or two long clips in Vegas and render it out in um, HD, and then send it to me via like Dropbox or something, put it in a Dropbox folder, let me have yeah. access to it, and then I would, I would, then I could edit it and try and sync it up with my gameplay and audio, right? Yeah. That's the easiest way to do it, and that you would get the the best quality from it, video visual wise, and audio wise. And then there's mm-hmm. and then we could do it where we could do both screens in the same thing, very easy. You know what I mean? It wouldn't be a yeah. hassle to get both screens on the same screen if we wanted to do that. If not, yeah. That's still the easiest. Using Fraps is still the best way, except when you render out the render out your portion or my portion, whoever's going to do the final edit, they don't have to re- render out the video, just the audio. Okay. So, that, I think, other than that... So what games we could do? We could do Assassin's Creed. That's coming up. Uh, Battlefield just... Battlefield will just be fun to play with each other just so we can do our own commentaries and whatnot or whatever. Yeah. And then do, like, combined stuff with maybe one footage or whatnot. I'll uh, either mm-hmm. do that via Skype or I, I found this I found a cool program uh, I looked it up yesterday or whatever to okay. so you could record multiple microphones from your computer um, at the same time like so you don't have to have any syncing things or worry about that yeah so it makes it easier if we're what, in the same room and we could what's use, that called uh, it is called uh, I feel like I know Crystal Crystal. Yeah, K R I S T A L. Yeah. Never mind, I haven't heard of that. Um, whatever. But I haven't used it yet because I haven't had anyone like in the same room with me to do a recording with or anything. But I'm gonna try it out with some things. I think maybe. But mm-hmm. um, that's just a cool idea because I was trying to look up how to do that with Audacity, but you you can't. So that's when you use like a soundboard or a switchboard thing and. Yeah. You know so uh, that's rocking with that. So, I don't know. I don't really know what games are coming out even. They delayed all the games that I was excited for. I was excited for Watch Dogs. They delayed that. Oh, yeah. I think maybe we just maybe hit up some classic games. Once you get more money and you can buy... I feel like we'll be so content with Battlefield because we'll, be we'll be able to play with each other like once or twice a week. Yeah. It, it'd make the... It, it honestly... Because I can't play... I can't play any... I can do the Conquest Domination game modes or the, the new Domination game mode and stuff. I can play that by myself. And be fine with it, cause like you can kind of carry the team in a way, mm-hmm. or at least really try to. But when you play Conquest or Rush or any of those games, you can't carry the team by yourself. Yeah, and I can't, and it really bothers me. That's why I don't really play it that much, and that's why like it it like dies out on me, cause I just can't carry the teams that much. So yeah, that'll well, be fun. Go ahead. I wouldn't really say it's carrying the team per se. Like, That's a Call of Duty term. Yeah, I would say it was. It'd be more like, like you actually seeing your impact in the game. Yeah, you know what I mean. You have you have a like, like you feel like you're actually doing something, mm-hmm. not just yeah. 
Okay. Yeah. So, I think we maybe do some of those new games. Other than that, like, what games are there we could do? I think of when I think of an older games, we could do the Left 4 Deads. Those mm-hmm. are big ones. Minecraft. Did you ever get a server going? We could do Borderlands, too. Borderlands, you and me. Both of them. That could oh, be yeah. fun. I've never played either of them. I feel like I'd have more fun doing it with somebody. Um, I'm looking at my games here, and I'm going off. Uh, we could push Dead Island, maybe, but those games we've already both started on our own, so that's kind of far-fetched. Maybe, maybe the portals. Those are two games. Honestly, I'm just kind of, I just thought about Minecraft and how we gotta get a server going so we can play. Yeah. I should probably look, honestly. Uh oh. Uh oh. Are you in trouble? No, someone just yelled at me. Alright, well, anyways. Okay, so you're, okay, you're good. I thought you were gonna, I thought you were, uh, okay. So, I don't know, I, I sh- I'll probably look at how to make a Minecraft server or something or figure it out. I know I could. So, it's really easy. I mean, I'll, I'll probably look it up. I'll, I'll get to it, honestly. It's something that I probably I need to do, or I should do, because I want to do it. And now that you have your computer, there's really no reason why I shouldn't do it anymore. Because if I have it up and running, then you could then you just go on it and play when you play Minecraft or whatever. Do you still play yeah. Minecraft often? Yeah, yeah, I'm playing it. I was just playing it yesterday with some of my friends. Yeah. All right. I mean, I really don't have anyone to play it with when it comes to like the multiplayer stuff, so I really don't. And I haven't done any Let's Plays or anything, so... I haven't been playing it that much. Mm-hmm. So, um, I, I guess I'll, I'll, you know, let me write that down. I'll, I'll get on that. Let me write that down. I've got notebooks after notebooks here of stuff, of things to do. Yeah. And ideas written down. So, Minecraft server. But, um, okay, Minecraft server. That'll, that'll get, I'll look into that, of course. Um, yeah, so, no, I don't know, it's, it'll all happen in time, it'll be a slow process getting up, but once, once it's, you get your stuff and we get it all to work and whatnot, I feel like it'll be a lot easier. Yeah. You know, and like, honestly, when it comes to like, who, whose turn it is or whatever to edit the final product, the videos, whoever has more time that week per se, do, do it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, I'll, yeah. I'll I'll do it even if I don't have a lot of time because I don't really care. It doesn't take that long, honestly. Once you once you learn how to use the stuff and you do it frequently, it's really not that hard at all. To it's really I don't mm-hmm. think it is. Just like what, now me making thumbnails and stuff in Photoshop, it's not that hard. Yeah. So uh, I guess that'll be that'll be interesting. Hopefully, we'll get back to this thing one day a week and we'll have more of a solid footprint once we get going back into it because i honestly i feel like honestly once we get talking again more frequently i thought about this yeah it'll be better here uh if you if every time you go on your computer you log on to Skype because i'm always on so on steam if you just skype skype so if you just log on to skype we could talk more okay all right i guess i guess we'll do that i don't know. like honestly it's been weird I'm honestly not even like. Hi, hey, Michael has to go. Sorry. Bye. I just want to say thank you for everybody to watching and staying tuned and into the episode number 15 of the Stalker Effect. Uh, <laughs> you know, with the way life is, people get cut out and we have some mishaps. So we're trying to get back into it, of course, and I'm trying my best to get things to work and happen. So. Thank you guys for staying with us. Hope you enjoyed the short episode. Look for a sh- longer one either. Very soon, probably. Um, We're going to be smacking into this stuff. It's not hard to do, and we're going to be getting into it. Why? Because we can. So thank you, and I'll talk to everybody some other time. Bye from me, bye from Mike, and thank you for being there and supporting us.